Welcome, everyone. My name is Alex Weiser. I'm the Director of Public Programs of YIVO. And we're very pleased to have you here with us tonight for the album release of Schotten's Shadows um, with uh, Zizel Slobovich Ensemble and with Sasha Luria. Um, this is the third album in a series of, um, of recordings that draw from the Yale uh, Fortunoff Video Archive for Holocaust Testimonies, taking songs that are used in those testimonies and creating new musical arrangements um, with them. Um, and this, you know, this project we've featured uh, the last two iterations of this project um, at Evo events, and it really resonates with what we do at Evo of both safeguarding Jewish history, um, but also using it to create new scholarship and new cultural um, works for today. Um, so we're really pleased to be um, partnering with Yale to present uh, the album release for this album today. Um, also in, in uh, concert with International Holocaust Remembrance Day, which is this week. Um, so I'm gonna hand it over to Zizel Slipovich and Ensemble with Sasha Luria, who will tell you more about the project and lead you along. Um, but I wanna thank you all for joining us tonight, and thank you also to all those that are um, viewing online. Enjoy. Good evening, everybody. Thank you for coming tonight. Uh, this uh, songs from Testimonies uh, album release uh, event. I'm really excited to present it here with, together with my colleagues, uh, whom I'll, um, in fact, let me introduce everybody. Uh, we have Sasha Luria, our soloist. <laughs> Craig Udelman on the violin. We have Joshua Kemp on the accordion and piano. <laughs> Dmitry Ishenko on the bass. <laughs> My name is Zizel Slapovich. <laughs> Songs from Testimonies is a project by Yale University's Fortune of Video Archive for Holocaust Testimonies. This project artistically presents music and poetry performed by survivors in the testimonies collected by the archive since its foundation in 1979. This material you're about to hear is scattered across more than 4,400 Holocaust testimonies of survivors and witnesses to the Holocaust. Interviewees were asked to share their entire life stories, so naturally songs and poetry appear throughout the recordings providing us with the unique historical source as, and giving us a window into these individuals' experiences. Many of the songs in the collection came from the pre-war period, while others were composed during the Holocaust in ghettos and camps. Tonight, we will ourselves bear witness to these testimonies of survival together with you. We will hear the survivors' own voices recount snippets of songs that describe the worst uh, perpetrators and collaborators, as well as more lighthearted songs performed for entertainment um, in ghetto taverns and theaters. 
and even crude and anti-Semitic songs sung by soldiers uh, in whose hands the singers' lives rested. Some of these songs can be challenging to listen to and even to perform, uh, to literally put their voices in our own and to try express what they felt takes a lot of research and consideration and equal amount of chutzpah. Yet more than three decades after this inconceivable trauma, the survivors not only remembered the songs word for word, but felt compelled to share them, um, always with a complicated smile, um, as if they finally are telling the punchline to a joke that was never funny. By performing these songs, we aim to lift up the survivors' voices, shining a light on the diversity and complexity of their lives before, during, and after the Holocaust. As the generation of witnesses slowly passes, the responsibility to tell their stories falls on us. So today, just three days before Holo Holocaust Commemoration Day, we present music from the third volumes of Songs from Testimonies. Um, and as traumas of war, violence, racism, and hate continue to ravage our world, we read about new tragedies and hear testimonies from new survivors in the news and on social media, and even among our own friends and families. Well, there is no need to compare one tragedy to another. We hope that amplifying these voices and taking this time to step into their shoes will not only honor their experiences, but help us all act with more compassion and conviction in our own world. Jack M., born in 1916 in the Polish town of Szydłowiec, where he also served in the Polish army and during World War II was a ghetto prisoner. A remarkable folk singer, Jack performed numerous songs of different genres and languages as part of his testimony. It is worth mentioning in this particular event that two decades prior, in the 1970s, Jack had been interviewed for the YIVO's Yiddish Folk Song Project by the same interviewer, Toby Bloom-Dobkin, 
uh, who was joined by Michael Alpert in 1990. Jack's testimony had, uh, has provided a wealth of inspirational material for all three volumes of Songs from Testimonies. Jack learned this song, Loy Looney, not to us, in pre-war period in his hometown of Shidlovitz. Built around the cycle of Jewish holidays, this song portrays a gallery of vivid characters in the local community. Its title is a quotation from Psalms, not to us, O Lord, not to us, but to your name bring glory for the sake of your love and your faithfulness. Every, every holiday is mentioned in that. Every... Every, every holiday is mentioned in that room. Lesrik bench doch je hider reit when the sickes come to gain. Der wille fet as we starik up ki hit in get reiselt wing ois bis klein. And yet so in rap zu di, sei hacken dot rap. Aspodi in ze chalapusi, ze kaparusi, loiluni, loiluni. You got here Roshishuna in Sikis. Efscher hat er geheiert, die Geschichte von Homener Rosche. Und ich hab gereißen Er hat gewollt in Brücken jeden Tun, von der ganzen Welt. Gekommen ist ab Sire, von Schischen Habire, als mein Hot war frei. And when hot the cup gets in the air, side is the other one given to forget. As the hungry hot man hummin with the kinder, and what so so say, what say that in the hot pussy, the hot pussy.
During his younger years, Jack occasionally went to work in Warsaw. This is where he first saw and heard the Heufzingers, courtyard singers, who were essentially professional beggars with theatrical skills. Most commonly, they would make up rhymed, tear-jerking stories asking people to donate money, food, and clothes. Often blind and playing their banduras, the zithers, they were a class of storytellers that acted in a way uh, as society papers, telling the story from the town. The com this composition is a possible recreation of how a courtyard singer like that could be walking around town and sharing his songs using both Jewish and Ukrainian motifs. <laughs> Die 
Kein Groschen ist nicht so gut, auf kein Bereich gut zu kaufen. Die Mama, sie ist alt und sie ist mit. Kommen wir ja auf die Gassen, Marken und Häufen. In Sinsa, ja nur mit die Gerät. Kommen wir ja auf die Gassen, Marken und Häufen. In Sing sei ja nur mit dir geliebt. Oh, ich sag schon, mir mein Tochter, Mann, ich geh drei, wo sie bist, ja so, ja Batterie. Ich mach mein Jung, mach mein Jung, in Rotten bringt der Feuer, und ich hoff sich in der Jung. Die Welt ist kalt, die Kasoi, wie ein Ei, Ei, Ei. In drei Zeit Kasoi, wie ein Reidl. Oi, Helge, die Kleine, ja, so himmel, wacht, aber ja, ja, Ei, an der Mira, Kalem, Ei. A blind man warf zebes a rup. Val meine Augen sehen mir verstellt. Klug je Kinder nach klugt, a kaliker is a jertate. Sieben Kinder hob ja vor mut. In ein mit dem Nomen Salate, wie in der Weibel am Latino habe ich euch gehabt, aber ich sie finde mir nicht an Jonja. Oi, Kolosche Kinder, da kommt, ob gebrennt ist mir mein Terfu, verbrennt ist so jeh, mein Hatte. Was wollt ihr? Also mit einem Fuß soll ich tanzen? Will ich tanzen? Was tut mir nicht für ein paar Nüsse? Ay, 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 ay,
Valdis kalhdi kazoi vienajai Indreidze kazoi vienajai Alšoj Well, as you can see, music that has been recorded in the Fortune of Archive comes from quite a few styles and genres, and also lots of different places. And those of you familiar with our previous releases, and if you're not, they're around and available online and here tonight. Um, we have recorded songs in many languages, including Yiddish, German, Polish, Russian, Hebrew, French, Czech, other God knows what. Um, and now we will travel to the Greek city of Thessaloniki that used to be a home to a very important and large Jewish community. In his testimony, Pepo S., a native of the Greek town of Thessaloniki or Salonika, remembers staying in the ghetto situated in the Baron Hirsch quarter, the Jewish quarter of the city. He remembered two individuals of terrible conduct, Vital Hasson and Edgar Cunio. As Pepo said, Cunio exploited Jews in their vulnerable position, taking their money and abusing young girls. After the war, uh, after the war Cunio was convicted for collaboration. The lyrics of the song were supposedly written by the daughter of someone named Dr. Menashe. This song was surprisingly sung to the tune of a German love song, Lili Marlene, that became popular during World War II throughout Europe and the Mediterranean among both Axis and the Allied troops. <laughs> Πολίτα φύλακε τρέχουν να μην πάνε αργά. Πρώτο μα έρχεται το Χάουελ, το όνομα του Ντανιέλ. Μαζεύει αγκαρία και κάνει φασαρία. Proscritio, che sta brevutira, polita fila che strego, na mi pane arga, protos mader che de aue, to uno matu Daniel, ma se ve angaria, che cani fa sari.
Ich will nicht da weg an die Bonne. Ich will nur ein bisschen leben. Die Bonne nicht aufgeben. Oj, ta bona, ja nie chcę oddać bony, bo pinker jest cholera i bony nam odbiera. A szuka ze. Oj, di bony, ich will nicht da weg in die bony. We, ich will noch ein bisschen leben, die bony nicht abgeben, sei ja be jidisch. So this composition, di bony, can hardly be called a song. It is rather a gathering of rhymes by so-called Bona singers from Warsaw Ghetto. Bona was a food voucher without which one could not purchase food. Well, scarce and worse, these verses convey unspeakable tragedy of people who were dying from starvation in the street. Their bodies were later collected by the Pinkard Burial Society in the rather transparent ghetto lingo to give away your bona, your food voucher, meant to die. Hella R and Ada V, both for former prisoners of the Warsaw Ghetto, remembered the bona verses in Yiddish and Polish. Our setting of this little tune takes us to the sounds and streets of Warsaw Ghetto, where popular tunes are heard as Jewish musicians illegally entertain the Polish citizens to earn their living, while in the streets, people are clinging to their food vouchers, hoping to still have a bite to eat. Ich will nicht da weg an die Bonne. Ich will nur ein bisschen leben. Die Bonne nicht aufgeben. Oi, die Bonne. Ich will nicht da weg an die Bonne. Ich will nur ein bisschen leben. Die Bonne nicht aufgeben. Cheers. <laughs> 
In his testimony, Jack M. recounts how he has transferred, he was transferred to an open air forced labor camp in Sulejów, Poland in 1943-44. After work, the prisoners would gather in a barrack with a piano and a former Jewish courtyard singer, Moreno, from Warsaw, used to perform for everyone. One of Moreno's songs was a significantly altered variant of the world famous American song that we hope you will recognize. It is quite possible that this version originated in the Yiddish theater in Warsaw. Ich will noch einmal mich opessen sagen, find mein Hinger in noch Ich hab schon drei Take me in my Monat gehabt, ich schenk mir ein Stück alle Brüe. Ich bin aber gewesen, ein reicher Mann, man nur mir gewesen, aber liebt ihn bekannt. Gewesen aber war hoch, und heute bin ich an Haif Sherot Irfin Efsen. Man anerkennt nicht mein Talent. Man 
Zug, dass ich bin, eure Bottle scheu, in der Scher, wo der Philipp sind. The lyrics of the song Schotten's Shadows was composed in the Vilna Ghetto by Leib Rosenthal in, for the 1943 musical review Korene Jorn Weizene Teg, Rye Years, Wheat Days, which is a play on words while Weizene Teg sounds also like Ve zu die Teg, Woe to the Days. The review was performed by the Vilna Ghetto Theater, which functioned there during the entire time of Ghetto's existence, along with other cultural organizations. Sima S., born in Vilna, was a Holocaust survivor who shared her testimony with the Fortune of Video Archive. She was an actor in the Ghetto Theater and was directly involved in songs coming to life. Seinen wie Schottens, blond und still in der Nacht, und ihr Schotten versfacht, weckt sich eure Gestalt. Und ich habe nicht nur eine Zell, aber alle Zell Zell plötzlich mitgelebt, wie ich mit meiner äh, Gestalt. Mehr seine wie Schottens, was die Nacht hat zu spreit. Noch in der Versteht, wohin jeder geht, wer zum Leben verteilt. Heint, 
Hast du vertroffen mich doch fremd? Das ist mein Freude, was hat geschehen? Schon verschwenkt vom Gewitter. Ich bin ein Hefker, dich allein. Auf dem Weg, ein Heuler Stein. Keiner hört nicht mein Gewein. Keiner macht nicht mein Zitter. Als ein Mensch bin geraten, mir durch bin am Mess. Oder gar bloß erschrocken. Wenn Schotten verschwinden, was in Gräuigkeit sein wird, wie von Schotten was fällt, hält sich heiße Gestalt, wie die Sonne hält sich strahlt. Spreit. Nur sie eine versteht, wohin jeder geht, wer zum Leben wird. Nur sie eine versteht, wohin jeder geht, wer zum Leben wird. Joseph W. was born in Lodz, Poland, in 1929. When the Nazi occupation began, he and his family were locked in the ghetto. One of Joseph's brightest memories was of his close friend, Jankele Herschkowitz, um, who composed many songs in the Lodz ghetto and was famous as the ghetto troubadour. One of them, was Ghetto Getunio and remembered by Joseph. Nicht sorgen in nicht leben, es wird daheim noch, gibt noch werden, es wird noch Kartoffel euer sein. Wir haben schon Kuri, Mäker, Junte, Wettmann, Essen, Lecker, Trinken, von groben Karmo, Wein. Der, wo sollt, wird essen, du willst aber, wenn der, wo nicht, wird griechen, dabei, neu, joi, joi, Ghetto, Getunio, Getuch, Nakochana, Tishtaka, Maluschka, Itaka, Schubrana, der, wo sollt, der Hand, der Starko, der, wo strukt auf sich am Marko, Krieg von Schanzen in von Besten, Aquila-Posten, euch den Gästen, wenn du bist intelligent und akzent, reiße dich ein Diamess, und abreut und adress, in der singst auf Englisch sich auch yes. Sweda hai, da git noch werden, sweat noch Kartoffel euch sein. Wir haben schon Kur auf Mehlach, ja, und da wird man essen, lecklich trinken vom groben Karmelwein. Der, was hat, wird trinken, beharrkowe. Und der, was nicht, wird griechischen Abbau. Ghetto, ghetto, new, ghetto, na kochana, tish taka maluska, i taka shubrana. Der was hot a hand a starker, der was hot a zich a market. Kring von schenzlung von besten, a vila posten neue gressen. Wenn die bist intelligent und akzent. Dreist die Sicherin wie am Mess. 
on a bright, on a dress, in the zing stuff, English zig. Oh, yes. Meidlach zich alle schemen, nischke schminken, nischke bremen, nischke tabaren, nischke fei. Nisch rusch kaum de las, ja nischke minti kakoras, ja so huben zu waschen, nischke seif. Nies mart vione, seit nischt zitzi pulkes. Nor alle singt mit mir, dem Refrain, oi, oi, oi. Geht du, geht du nu, geht du na kochana, tisch da gamaluska, i da kasho brana. Der was hat a hand, a starker, der was drückt auf sich am Arke, kriegt von Schönsten und von Besten, a viel a Posten, neue Gressen, wenn die bist intelligent und a Zent. Dreist is ich a Riem, wie a Mess, und a Bräut, und a Dress, und du singst, Auf Englisch sich oi es. From the large ghetto, both Jankala and Joseph were deported to Auschwitz Birkenau, which they were both lucky to survive. Um, Stuben Elteste is the only song that Jankele Hirschkovich created there, according to Joseph's testimony. The word Stuben Elste is a dialect version of a German word Stuben Elteste. Um, in the concentration and slave labor camps, the word was used for a prisoner functionary assigned to assigned by the SS guards to the barracks to supervise forced labor. Stuben Elsto conveys the grim reality of everyday life in the camp. The Yiddish lyrics carry a strong influence of German as well as camp slang, which we would probably, Im it was it would be impossible for us to decipher if not for the advice given to us by Sam Norwich, the publisher of Jewish Daily Forward. Is, uh? And Josh Walewski. And Josh Walewski, who is in the house, I guess. Yes. So thank you, Sam, and thank you, Josh. Uh, so Sam happened to be born in a DP camp. And Sam said that they employed a lot of the same jargon that they had used in concentration camps, including some of the enigm enigmatic expressions we found in Stuben Elsto. Stuben Elster, gibst du Gepelster, einen mal so in den zweiten Apache, o hält mich rein, sind Stutze Kajen, o Maraba, ein Jäger ist auch wat. Kind bei ihnen frei, hab ich nicht an Rie, mich sich gleich antreten, in ich weiß nicht wie, dort im Klosett, sprach und dann rett, treffst du einen Schlufen, wie bei sich im Bett, Stuben Elster, gibst du Gepelster. Ich 
weiß nicht wie. Dort in Klosett sprachen Männer Treffst du einen Schlufen wie bei sich in der Bett. Stubenälste gibst du Gefällste. Einem Azug und dem zweiten Apach. Heb nicht schreien, es ist nicht zu zickeien. Um Araba ein jeder ist ein Quatsch. Kinder mit Tokschu, wer ich keil und gru, läuf ich dort und du, schreit auf dem Block, wo will er oben ruhen, sucht mir mit Heil, jeder sich eilt, Gruppe Kasche Manne, Kartoffel und Geschalt, Stube und Nelste, gibst du Gefällste, eine mal so und dem zweiten Apach, hey, nicht schreien. Die Portionen holen geht es mit dem Stock. Oh, ich bin nicht hat Ham, weil ich hab nicht Ham. Hält man dort ein Schreien, ey Jude, ja, tschä Damm. Stopp und Nelsta, gibst du Gefällsta. Einer mal so, komm dem zweiten Apach. Hält nicht Schreien. Es ist nicht stolz, es ist kein Marabba, ein Jäder ist ein Quart. Stobo Nelsta, gibst du Gefällste, ein Amazog und dem zweiten Apach. Hey, nicht schreien, es ist nicht stolz, es ist kein Marabba, ein Jäder ist ein Quart. We find this song, Schrei Herzele Schrei, Cry My Heart Cry, in more than one testimony, both in the Fortune of Video Archive and in the United States Holocaust Memorial Museum collections. It was sung by Maurice K., Willie F., and Frida burstin Radaski, who sang a fuller but also a slightly different version called Treblinke Dort, There Lies Treblinka. The song conveys the story of frequent deportations from Warsaw's Umschlagplatz to Treblinka as seen and felt by the ghetto prisoners. Today, in these times, this reminds us of how human will and power can get us through the hardest times. We're fighting, surviving, we're here. Wir sind Dort nicht weit ist der Umschlagplatz verleiht, wie man stirbt sich in der Breit zu die Waggonen. Dort hört man ein Geschrei, wie ein Kind schreit zu ein Mama, wir lassen mich allein, lass mir gehen zusammen. Die Polizei sei oben geheißen, schnelle Gei, der Westen nicht leiden, mehr kein Neut. Der Westpakim in drei Bräut, sei hob nicht gewiss, als er gehe neu verschnellen Teut. Treblinke dort, vor jeden Jeter geht dort. Sei hob nicht gewiss, als er gehe neu verschnellen Teut. In Treblinke dort, jeden ob man geht dort. Es ist ein Sturm auf der Welt, ein Abgegangen. 
Het had een velker verwandeld aan de lender. En Rachman is juist dik. Hoor af, gemacht de wereld. Die zoon van hemel erop gerissen. En van toe gemacht. Nou. Dort, nicht weit, steht ein Umschlagplatz verweit, wie man stiebt sich in der Breit zu die Wagonen. Dort hört man ein Geschrei, wie ein Kind schreit zu der Mama, wie los die mich allein. Polizei, sie haben geheißen, schneller gehen, die West nicht leiden mehr, kein Neut, die West bekommen drei bereut, sie haben nicht gewiss, als sie gehen auf Aschen und Teut, Treblinke dort, für jeden Jed a gita ort Ich du du dort Me kenn ich schreien mehr gehen Wort Es kommt dahin verbleibt mein dort Dort in Treblinke Das Herz sieht wei Wenn mit Hitz ich noch Vintate mame, kein Treblin gesamme. Schrei, Herzele, schrei, Herzele, sog nicht aus, als die Biest da geht. Schwesterin, Brüder, Tote, Mame, alle gehen zu alle gehen zu versammeln, was die bis dahin. Schrei, Herzele, schrei, Herzele, sog nicht aus, als die bis dahin. Before we go to perform this last song, let me introduce again the artists, Craig Udelman on the violin, <laughs> Joshua Camp on the accordion and the piano, <laughs> Dmitry Ishenko on the bass. Woodwinds and artistic direction, Zizel Slipovich. <laughs> and our soloist is Sasha Luria. We would like to thank the Fortune of Archive for Holocaust, Fortune of Video Archive for Holocaust Testimonies, and its director Stephen Naron. Where's the camera? 
Yevil Institute for Jewish Research, <laughs> Center for Jewish History, New York City Department of Cultural Affairs, and the City Council for making this event possible. <clears throat> the last song in this program is Zokshan Lechodoidi. Say or sing Lechodoidi. It was composed in a concentration camp by Yehezkiel Sharga Rotenberg, who was a member of Bobov Hasidic community in Poland. Rodenberg was killed in the Holocaust, but is outlived by numerous songs. Um, his songs were aimed at boosting the morale in, in the communities in the hardest times. They quickly gained popularity among Jewish camp prisoners in Poland and later spread all around the world. Moshe B who went through several concentration camps, happened to recall this song. Ania, schon kim di je schia, wenn ich nicht so ihr noch schöne befrie, ihr rollt die Lo, lecho, lecho, ho doidi, ja, hat kilom hoidi, likras kalwa schier faral, na schabos ne kablo. Oi aloi se voi shi di ai da kdoi shi betn zich mer nit shemen veloi si kolme le oilem le oltme yes ru el le vedenemen ma te shte chachis Let me start over. Sorry. How <laughs> Loise voi shi di ai da gdoi shi vet zich mer nit shemen ve loise komele omele om yesru ele vedenemen ma te shte kakis vern vern glai hale ein ge boi gene jiden i matte mi greit eich zi mit freile ge ge mi ma Sokshen lecho doidi, yachad kilam hoidi, 
Okay, we can pretend to walk off and just come back. Is that okay? 
Okay, we'll pretend like, you don't need to turn that on, yeah? <laughs> we'll pretend like this, we'll save you some time. And just go straight to what we didn't prepare and spontaneously are playing an encore for you, okay? Among the songs that the young prisoners in Treblinka, including Irene S., sang to support their faith and hope for survival and liberation were Hebrew songs they had learned in Poland before the war. After the State of Israel came into existence, Anima Amin, also known as Sachki Sachki, became a popular song there. The lyrics are a poem re written by Shaul Cher Chernikovsky in 1894 in Odessa in Ukraine. For the last couple of years, this is a moment when every time we played this song, I would say something about Ukraine, the beautiful land that is going through horrible things. I think the world is complicated and today, just like every other day, unfortunately, there are more things to talk about than one war. So we're gonna sing a song about hope and believing in humanity because we can be stronger together and build a better world together. If Shaul Chernikovsky believed in it in 1894, I hope we can believe in it in 2024. Schönen Dank. <laughs> 